Hi guys, sorry for the background noise. I just want to show this saw off quickly. Um, I've been using it for the time I've been here and we've been cutting wood for, let me just show you that there. That's the camping stove. I've done a review of it before. It's doing excellent. Um, I sit there, my girlfriend sits on the other side and it gives off a good amount of heat for in the evenings. Um, easy to feed. We open the top lid off to toast marshmallows cook food on it and also we boiled our water with it so that's doing excellent so as a little update bonus there but I just wanted to show you the um, saw I've been using in the meantime uh, that I've been I took on this trip because this one you've probably seen us on eBay and on Facebook groups and stuff um, I bought this off the trade group I think so basically you got two saws do fit um, in the cylinder. Um, I put the long rod bit into the um, cross bit there and then all you do is just take that out. Uh, sorry for the kids playing football, I can't do much about that. So cross beam uh, goes in there into the long holes in place and then you have the two slits either end um, and then just pick a blade and I can't see what I'm doing but put one in there one in there and on the blade on the end of them is these little kind of like rivet bits there which help it stay in place and then you just have the long rod left over which goes into the last hole so really you can't really forget to how to put this in or what parts go where because if you do it wrong, uh, you'll find out quick. A little bit just fell off. Uh, there. And then you just tighten it up. And that's it. That's solid. It's not moving around. It's not wiggling. You know. And I'll um, I'll grab a piece of wood now and just show you again how um, how fast it cuts. Don't mind the crock, I'm relaxing. Right. Let me see. Nice cut, pretty quick. That's a good size thing there. So, so there you have it. What day camping are we now? Five. Day five of day five of camping and this is holding up really well. Use it every day. Like I said, very lightweight and uh, nothing to it putting it together. So if you do see one on Facebook group or the Bushcraft group uh, trade post, uh, pick one up. I think I paid I said twelve pound or less. I can't remember. I had a it a while ago. I just keep this uh, in my bushcraft bag just in case um, I'm out and I need to cut something but I only use this for fire prep really so for those of you complaining that I do videos in backyard all the time hey so I'm out in the woods now camping or the rest of it for five days I got two more days left um, and then I go back um, so if you can watch all the videos I put out recently um, that would help the channel a lot help me out um, also make sure to subscribe to the channel a lot of YouTube has been playing up a lot lately they're not pushing videos channels big and small are complaining about it but YouTube doesn't seem to care too much about that um, so if, if you think you're subscribed just double check if you're not can you please subscribe and if you like the video please give me a thumbs up thanks guys for watching I'll catch you next video bye